so second video review for this week is for The Probability of Love by Dina Blake. If you want to check out my review, I have just posted that. So if you're on YouTube, there's a link in the description below. And if you're on Facebook or on my blog, then there is a link within the post. And this is the video review. So The Probability of Love by Dina Blake. So much fun. So much fun. And if you haven't seen the cover, oh my God, it's got an amazing cover. Um, Blair and Rachel, they indulge in this passionate night in Las Vegas, um, which when they then meet again, leads to um, more of a passionate weekend affair and then Rachel returns home and Blair is left wondering if there could have been more between them um, but fate brings them back together really unexpectedly and uh, Blair is in danger of falling for Rachel completely um, even though she's sure that Rachel doesn't want anything more serious than what they've already shared so um, what an emotional right honestly um, there's so many magical moments, purely amazing connection between these two really, really fantastic characters. And if you've read other books by Dina, then um, you'll know there's a few lovely surprises throughout this great story too. So um, absolute treat. And I loved, I loved it. I was like, oh, that's so funny. Like, so if you've read any of Dina's other books, this one's a definite must read because you're going to love it. Um, I absolutely love the torment that uh, both Blair and Rachel inflicted upon themselves they did it to themselves honestly um Rachel just was holding back on everything she was certain that love couldn't happen uh, she didn't believe it could happen on a whim she couldn't believe that Blair was like this perfect person that she had this connection with that she could have anything more with than what she'd sort of experienced for the weekend and she couldn't believe that Blair would even be interested in her and then just as she started to believe Blair's friend um Morgan she she just she just threw everything up in the air and it really threatened to ruin everything it was it was that moment where you were like oh, no don't say that don't do that um I was on the edge of my seat at so many moments in this um the will they won't they and I was just really hopeful for Blair I just was like I really hoped she would follow her heart I really hoped she would like try and pursue this with Rachel because she was going to have to put in a lot of work um Rachel was so uncertain and um, just not give up based on how Rachel reacted to certain things as well. It was like it wasn't worth it. But um, it was very, very exciting. And it was one of those dream take a chance stories. Do you know what I mean? Like it just, you don't imagine this could happen in real life, but you know it does, it must. Um, and it was just, it was something like, yeah, could be straight out of the movies, like, but the reality is when you go places like Vegas and you go places that have this air about them magical things do happen and you know they do you've heard them like they're real life stories as well and I just love that it was like that that fine line between and it was so realistic in that respect that Rachel's so down on everything and yet she turns up you know she's gone away for this work thing and then she's just met the perfect person because it happens when you least expect it and I absolutely love that um, but I'm really really excited for Dina's next story and um, they always capture my heart they always make me believe in finding love and happiness at any moment Dina delivers that so well um, and I just really really loved it and enjoyed it so I'm really hoping you will too I will pop a link in the description so you can go and grab a copy of The Probability of Love by Dina Blake. So I um, hope you do that. Um, if you've read The Probabil Probability of Love, oh, I put my teeth back in. If you've read The Probability of Love, um, it would be great to hear from you. Um, let us know what you liked about the story and what you enjoyed. And if you haven't read it yet, but you're planning to read it or it's on your to be read list, please do let us know because it's always great to know what you are reading um, or planning to read. And as I said, if you do read it, I just hope you have a lot of fun reading it. I hope you really, really enjoy it. Bye.